What's up, you awesome people? I'm Julian, coming through with a brand new audio review for you from the musical Epic, and this is from Epic, The Ventral Saga. This song is Get In The Water. It was dropped four days ago. It's currently sitting at the number eighth most trending spot, and it has over 860,000 views. Now, like I said, this is an excerpt or a song from the musical Epic, and the people that are credited on this one are George Rivera Herons, Wanda Herons, uh, Steven Rodriguez, Steven Dukey, and Armando Julian. Uh, so just before we dive in and go, a link to the music video or audio, I should rephrase that, audio video is down below. But hey, please show some love to the channel and help it to grow by whamming that like button and bamming that subscribe button. Thank you. Now let's dive right in. So understanding that this is much more of like like a moment from this epic play that happens to be named Epic. I've never seen it, but it sounds epic, so I'm just gonna assume it's epic. Yeah, I know, I'm putting the bar pretty high, so I hope y'all are epic. For, real quick, has anyone seen it? Like, let me know, is it epic? And like, what is it about? I can only judge it on these crazy audio clips. And so this one is a very Game of Thrones mixed with Pirates of the Caribbean feel. Get in the water. It's literally the whole, or at least the beginning part, I should say, is someone just saying, get in the water. So it sounds like someone's on the plank, you know, of a ship. Or that's just what I picture. You know, obviously it's on a, it's a play, so they're not really on a plank. But let's just imagine that they're on a plank. So you hear somebody say, get in the water, and this other person doesn't want to get into the water. Understandably, it is November, so the water is very cold. Also, you have no idea if he's tied up, like what the situation is. And basically, it's just a very epic sounding moment, it, you know, um, that eventually I will say progresses. I'm assuming the person went into the water, but I'm not sure because at the end of the song, you just hear like, like, you need to learn forgiveness. And I'm like, you know, what? I think we all need to work on forgiveness. But I just got to say, it's a very epic sounding moment. And like I said on the last review of my, this epic saga, um, pieces, I said something that I want to double down on. I think it would be so cool, even if they just showed an excerpt of the play to visually go along with the audio, super cool. Unless they didn't want to, so our imaginations would go wild, and now we'd all want to be like, hey, we want to see the play, and then, hey, we want to get their album. It, you know, if you do, I, I more just want to see the play, personally. Like, they've now sold me on wanting to see the play, probably wouldn't get their album. I think it's really cool. And I would love to hear, you know, this song while I see the play, obviously. But it's not a song that I'm going to be requesting, recommending, or suggesting necessarily. But I will say it's inspiring just for, like, an epic-sounding piece. Like, to me, this would be cool if it was, like, a book on tape. Imagine that. Imagine if books on tape had the same production value that this play does audioly. Because to me, that would be epic. I would just dive into all these books on tape if they sounded like that. But, hey, that's what I got to say. Have you seen Epic? Let me know. Also, what's your favorite song regardless if you've seen it or not that's off their album the epic vengeance saga let me know i'm curious also what do you think of this kind of moment do you feel it's as epic as they claim to be or do you think it's kind of more of like not your cup of tea let me know i'm curious and in the meantime cheers players forget them haters and enjoy daylight savings